what's going on guys it's Tate there and we're back with another video for yourselves and today as you can see we're continuing on with the days gone walkthrough for yourselves um, I know it's been a couple of days since I've uh, actually released another video on this but um, it is Saturday today I'm going to be cracking down with two videos of these today because I obviously have been lacking um, but uh, yeah let's get straight into this guys Where we left off last time, it was just where we found O'Brien, I'm pretty sure. Um, which is a big part of the story. Um, so I'm, I'm really excited to see what's going to happen next, honestly. I'm going to pop this on now. Get into the game. But, uh, yeah. Basically, um, last night I went on Amazon and I ordered some uh, LED lighting as well, for, like for my room, um, just to put like underneath my desk and stuff. Um, so hopefully it should give it a little bit more of a vibe in my room. Um, I've ordered some curtains as well because, as you can see by my webcam, everything is red. <laughs> if, like, if I go into like a certain position, like it, it kind of changes. Yeah, look, like there you go. Like when I go closer to it, it kind of changes, but like, I don't know, I, d I don't understand it. I guess it's just the colour of it, which is just, it baffles it. See, look like now, look, it's normal. And then when I move again, it's red. Like, <laughs> I don't know if it's because of the, well, it's a, I think it's just a mixture of the, the redness and the webcam, which I've got. Um, so, uh, yeah, basically, needs, uh, everything basically needs to be upgraded. Um, but obviously I'm not going to, you know, just splash out and everything at once. Um, I'm going to gradually get new things as, you know, as we go throughout um, the months. Um, especially since we're in a love of lockdown as well now. I don't want to be getting into a habit of buying loads of things. Um, you know, just outright and not even think about it whatsoever. Um, Where's Tucker? But yeah, Alki. let's get it, boys. The dig site. Well, which one, goddammit? The north one. Back there. Anybody touches this bike or anything on it, I break your fingers. No, I remember that then. I'll break your fingers. Yes. <coughs> All right, let's go find Tucker and LK. <coughs> Price on your head. Not good, boys. But yeah, hopefully the PS4 isn't too loud again as usual because it, as usual, it's just like a hair dryer and a. I keep um, telling you, everywhere you look, it's all one giant lava field, twenty-five feet solid rock. But we're in better protection then. <laughs> Jackhammers do. I don't need a lecture, goddammit. I get it. No, you don't. But these people are hungry, even if they had all their strength. It'll take him months to finish his job with picks and shovels. I don't give a shit. Whoa. We're all hungry, Al. But this job's got to get done whether it takes all goddamn year. It's not like we got somewhere else to be now, do we? Wait. Ooh. Not finished. We'll make it quick, will you, Al? I got things to do. Grippers. This morning, one of my men spotted a large group of them coming over the pass. And no one stopped them. How the f Tucker, you know we're already spread thin. Are, are they headed north? Al, are they headed towards us? Yes or no? I, I don't know. Oh, great. Maybe he knows. <laughs> what the fuck are you oh. up to now, huh? What's this about, huh? Damn it, I'm kind. It's not his job to know. It's your goddamn job to know. I can't be at two places at one time. You either want me here, running your dig, or you want me out there in the shit, chasing the rippers. Go check the store, see how much ammo we got left. I'll tell Wheeler to watch the dig. What are you looking at? I don't know, just waiting for you to smarten the fuck up. Don't! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. Keep on moving, man. Did you track down Leon? <coughs> Good thing someone around here knows how to make things happen. Ride with me. Well, ride with you, girl. No, I'm just. <laughs> what the f 
fucking say something. How long has it been since you found someone? <laughs> I did not expect a little cold kind of caddy. Down the shit aren't the kind of people you want me bringing in. We lost too much. What? It's not my problem. You want our food? I'm making it your problem. I told you we'll do runs for you, but we're not joining your goddamn camp. Remind me again, my old woman's memory. Why is that? <laughs> because it's a waste of time, Tuck. <laughs> well, aren't you the optimist? Where's Boozer? I said he was gonna head over to Copeland's camp, see about trading for some fish. You're not in bed with Tuck um. now, are you? His camp near yours? It's not closer or further. Look, I'm not Boozer's old lady. He goes where he wants. <laughs> Jesus. You keep the shit burning all day and night. Got a lot of freak corpses piling up out here. With men like you doing your jobs. Damn right we keep it burning. Try using more gasoline. It burns faster, less Down, fumes. brother. Like we got so much to spare? When it's all gone, what are you going to put in that bike of yours? Spit and sweat? Now what the hell is going on here? The count's off. Storage is missing food and some ammo. Jesus. Who was on watch last night? Wheeler. Tonight, double the watch. This shit's starting to piss me off. You got it. Trouble in paradise. It's like I was saying. Camp's like a prison. Bunch of goddamn lazy liars, thieves, rapists, and murderers. You know why that is? No idea. Because that's who we are. The freak show. Only nice. folks survived were those mean enough, nasty enough to out freak the freaks. Oh, big camp. The rest are here. Hope that I feed them, protect them, keep them nice and cozy and warm so they can sit on their asses and watch the world end. You, get your ass back to work. Don't make me go get Cyrus. <laughs> Lazy sons of bitches can screw around all they like. Uh, on yes, ma'am. Daytime Sorry. is my time. I've only just sit a man for like two seconds, man. I can't remember. What you said. You were, you were what? You were a warden or something? <laughs> Nothing so high and mighty. I was matron of the women's ward. You look like the sort who might have spent some time in a pen back in the day. You ever do time? I had my share of trouble, but I never landed. What was the case. point in that? Literally just on a full lap. <clears throat> Larson was on a run yesterday. Passed through Marion Fork, said he saw someone. Young woman looked like, but he only caught a glance. He stopped to look around, but he never found her. Is he sure? Larson's been doing this long as you. He knows a person from a freak. But you got a knack for this. You head over there and find her before the freaks do. I'll see what I can do. But look, Tuck, I want the rest oh, of my Oh, thanks for dropping me off on my bike. If you bring me warm bodies, I'll give you all the credits you can spend. And now you're making me walk. Oh, that's a raw thing, you know. Alcott. What do you want, Drifter? What's your problem? Hmm? One of my men uh, escaped to Ripper Camp over by Iron Butte. Got tortured, like they always do. But this time, they kept asking me if he knew about it. Two bikers, two men, asking if he'd ever seen them or heard of them. A lot of bikes around here. What's it? <laughs> got to do with me the ripper called the mongrels how many drifters still flying colors around here as if that shit matters if you ask me you got a price on your head how's it feel to be on the other side now why don't you just show me what you got because I don't have time for your bullshit whatever you say Deke so he's saying I've got a price on my head. By who though? Ooh, hello. Hello. Oh yes, you're looking fine today, eh? I can't buy anything though. Oh, I can buy a pistol. That right there, good piece. Yeah, that's about it. <coughs> Trying to make it my number one. Find me if you need yeah, that'd be calm. So is the pistol upgraded already? Yeah, it is. Okay. Uh, I have no bolts for the thing. Craft. Five. Nice. That's calm. 
I just gotta figure out who I'm gonna give this to. Okay, oh, so we have two choices there. Bring the Drake stash to Tucker. Alkai has weapons for sale that are better than yours. Bring the Drake stash to Copeland. Money promised to help restore your piece of shit bike. <laughs> um. I feel like the bike could be better, to be honest, because we need to get around quite a lot. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna Can't do Cape Land. North until I get this bike fixed up. Copeland, it is. Yeah, hundred percent. Jason Leon, eighty-three percent done. Uh, right, we want to go to map. Okay, so. Uh, so is this the go plan one? No. Wherever what? Oh, deliver cape lands. There you go. That's what we want to do. Trust increased. Hot springs level friendly. Hey man. Yeah, this is where we want to go. Just give me a second. Yes, better. In a bit, boys. I do really like the driving in this game. It's so smooth. Like 1.7k. So yeah, we don't have any nitro or anything. I'm pretty sure if my bike gets fixed by the skeezer and we get nitro back I think well, I'm assuming so because we had it on there before didn't we and I don't know I know I drift again no, ok yeah it's uh, <coughs> can you wheelie in this game? nah Ooh, to be fair, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll help you, bro. Oh, oh, oh! Yeah, bro, I got you, man. There you go, bro. Four bounties. Let me get you out of there. You're gonna die out here. I know of a camp where it's safe. No, no, where? Where? I'll go. Uh, we'll go to, uh... Nah, we'll go to Copeland again, because... Peaceful Lake. Mark Copeland. It's safe there. Oh, my God. Thank you so much. <laughs> I thought I was going to die in there. Name's Deacon. They know who I am. Stay off the main roads. Don't stop. <laughs> Doing my trusty deed for the day. St. John. For me is all. I know you ride. Try the radio up. Can't seem to reach him. When you see him, you tell him to swing by and say hello to Cope. Much appreciated. Cope and out. To be fair, since this is a long journey for you guys, I'm actually just going to uh, skip it and you guys so that you don't have to you know just watch this all the way um i'll obviously keep a little bit included uh, to show off whatever but uh yeah apart from that i'll see you guys there again boozer's fine like i said he's just been busy doing runs for that son of a bitch mark copeland no doubt I get the feeling he doesn't Ooh. like me much. Loser, I mean. Like I said, I ain't his old lady. He deacon out. I'll fill her up real quick. No pit stop. Oh, here we go. That should be it. Yeet! There's a bunch of nests, uh... 
So yeah, like, uh, I'm pretty sure I said this in the last episode, uh, or the one before. Basically, once I've finished the storyline mode, I'll actually uh, go back to all these like infestations areas um, and clear out all the nests and stuff like that, because there's so many side missions as well which you can do. Um, which is great. Yeah, that's what I love about games like this. Can I get through this smoothly? Oh! Oh, that was sweet driving. Hello! <laughs> I hope we can increase the uh, the speed of the bike as well, to be honest. Look at that drifting, bro. But yeah, hopefully uh, we can increase the speed of the, uh, the bike itself. Because it's quite slow at the moment. All right, nice. We're here. The drifter, let him in. No trouble, okay? Hey, been seeing you around. What's up? I wonder about... Hey, Cope. I think Leon was bringing you this. Gee. <laughs> you made a wise choice. A wise choice. Uh, you go see Manny. Maybe he can help you with that bike of yours. Oh, he better, man. Bro, all the shit for topic just being through, man. Alright, right, little trophy, special delivery. Manny, what's going on? Alright, man. What's up? You looking for something? Then you can refuel here. Okay, man. Thanks, man. Alright, so is he gonna do anything to the bike or? Say what? So I've just done all that. It doesn't look too bad. No way. Hope says you've been helping out around the camp. He won't say it, but he appreciates it. Hey, Manny. Oh, right, I'm actually gonna, yeah, I'm gonna upgrade that straight away. Good choice, man, good choice. Engine one, nice. Uh, exhaust, noise reduction. Definitely get that. Gas tank, ooh. Uh, ugh. Frame on the. To be fair, we kind of need some ammo. Hey um, All right. You see what do you need? What do you need? Hey. To be fair, we got pistol ammo. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Looking for something in particular? Yeah, I'll have some shotgun Good ammo. Choice. Now that's what I'm talking about. Okay. So I've got, a, I've got a suppressor now. Later, man. That's gonna be quite cool. All right, clear out the lodging camp. Uh, wait, is this the is this the main mission now? Storyline, storyline. No doubt of his mind. Locate the drifter. Uh, clear the lodging camp. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna go here. We're gonna clear out this lodging camp. Oh my days! Look how quick it goes now. That's just engine one. Deke, you there? Boozer, the hell aren't Let's you Get you? it, boys. I couldn't sleep. Remember what I said back in the tunnel? Don't go out there, Deke. And it's got a little bit of noise it's reduction as well. Obviously, it's a little bit louder because of the engine now. Go up there because there's freaks out there. Oh, so much better. Yeah, you get like a little, uh, to the bottom right of the mini map just then. Um, got like little question marks, like blue ones. They're obviously like little side quests you can do. Alright, here we go, lads. 
feel like this is going to be uh, pretty rough to do. Freaker infestations. Freaker infestations are highly dangerous areas where freakers congregate to build their nests to hibernate during the day. Vernal nest infestation to clear out the path for fast travel. Who would go? Alright. One of them was a man named Randall. Been with the camp almost a year. I didn't know the other two. You want me to ask? No, I guess not. You find that son of a bitch, you radio me. Copeland out. Alright. We've only got one Molotov. Okay, this is it. Yeah. Oh, oh this camp is gonna be crawling. Oh, yeah, going on fast, nice and quiet. Yeah, not bad. Of course, the press is really good. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. Back during the American Revolution, when we were fighting for our freedoms, we gained the beautiful right Ooh. to keep and bear arms. The right we used to protect ourselves. Our families, our property. That is, until the Everglades federal government got scared of the people they swore to protect. What shot? They stripped us of every gun we had in the back, using a few mass shootings as an excuse to curtail the God-given rights of us, American nice. citizens. Nice. Gun control. And there, oh fuck. Oh my days, blood up. This is how the feds run it. Disarming the public was just the first step toward getting rid of us all. So who did those gun laws really protect? Ah, cool. Sure as hell wasn't us, the American taxpayers. You can find the rags and stuff, but... Okay, the bear bottle. Okay, so we can grasp, we can grasp one. Another bear bottle. Grab two. Okay, cool. That's probably be good, gonna be enough, to be fair. I hope, anyway. Oh, we gotta go inside, boy. Gonna get busy now. Oh my days! I actually just died. No way. Oh yeah, the nest. Okay, you boys just keep on sleeping. Don't pay no attention to me. Alright. Accuracy is kind of getting there. That one down. Is there gonna be anything in there? I was hoping it was going to be a first aid or something. I need a sterilizer. Yeah, I'm going to suppress her now. Shit yourself at once, Jesus Christ. 
I missed so many shots. Okay. Right, so there's two in here. Oh shit! Pens now. Shit. Goddamn freaks. What the hell are you doing in here? Huh? There's so many nests in here. This place is a death trap. Go. I need more materials, man. I need to build some stuff. Oh, God. I'm dead again, boys. I'm literally dead again. I don't know what to do. My this is um, Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. Yeah. Broke another goddamn razor this morning. In our supposed global utopia, instead of getting the best products from around the world, we got the shittiest products cheap foreign labor could churn out. Everything in the last 50 years was built to break, so that you could buy once, buy again, buy, buy, buy. You always had to get the new car, the new phone, the new this and that. All to feed the beast of crass commercialism. You want something built okay. to last? You I need one more ball. No you need real, hard-working Americans at the helm. When we build something, it'll stand the test of time. And the same hands that built this country, they'll withstand anything this new world throws at us. Our roads bend, friends. Neither will we. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the no, lies. Hiding me. Oh, that. They look pretty broken to me, Cope. But hey, whatever you say. Eh, nothing wrong with a little crap. Mother. Okay, cool. Boom. All right, let's get it, lads. All right, we got the uh, we got the goods. Craft another band aid. Use that real quick. Okay, we got health. We got battles. We got Mali's. Alright. Shank this. Dead. Alright. Run back in there. Ah, let's do this. We're gonna do this. Try well, we're gonna try and do all three at the same time. Right. Come on, fellas. Ah, let's go. There's gonna be so many zombies coming now. Come on, Come get this bread. Is that the last of them? <sighs> Finally. Come on, bro. You don't want this smoke. Boozer, it's done. I cleared those nests. Should be less freaks on the mountain from now on. Yeah. Where are they? 
Oh, Seigneur, sit down. It's so satisfying when you get a headshot. Don't slap me. Slap you back on my days. Suck on this. Oh, it's got to be some loot in here, surely. Alright, I'll take that. Yeah. Nest residue. Um, yeah, yeah, really I need that. It's probably up here, which is probably a little bit of loot. Maybe not. Okay. Take it back. Aye. Alright, I'm glad that's over with. Because <laughs> that was a pain in my ass. Um, but yeah, so we'll carry on then. So, where are we going now? Uh, we are going... Wow, we are going very far. Can I not fast travel anywhere? Um Wait, chasing Leon, yeah, that's what we wanna continue. Alright, we're gonna do that then. Them will never hurt. Oh, yeah, man. I gotta finish burning out this infestation zone. Gas. I do need gas. Well, I'm sure I will need gas anyway, because I haven't refilled in a while. Yeah, 34%. Boom. Dash that. Oh, it's flying. Yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying uh, these videos. Oh my. I'm gonna die. Oh shit. As I was saying, I hope you guys are enjoying these videos, um, <laughs> before I kill myself on it. Um, because yeah, I'm really enjoying it, really I'm enjoying it at the moment, um, and I'm really excited to, uh, to continue. I need to repair this real quick. Damn, I took four scraps I did. Oh. 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 God damn. Oh, we can't even burn the body, man. We haven't even got any. We need a bottle. We need a goddamn bottle, man. Like, where are we going to get a bottle from? Bro. Oh yeah, I forgot we could do this. I shoot him with a double barrel shotgun and he doesn't die. And then I get slapped. <laughs> that is three times in one episode, fam. 
I'm dead. Let's see what I can do. I smell it. <sighs> Gotta be dead. Another one. Yeah, time to light it up. There's got to be a, a bottle here, man. How isn't there? Okay, I've got one here. Oh, I can't use it for the nest. Alright, well, at least, at least we found one anyway. Alright. Don't worry, Alvarez. I'm not gonna leave you to the freaks. Because we gotta respect this woman, right? Which got beaten. We can't just leave her out in the streets, man. Alright. Okay, wait. I've got two shots. Okay. Rest in peace, my out. love. Completed. <coughs> Chase and Leon, that's completed now. Boom. Yo, hold on a sec. Did you just see that? Bro. Who's there? You there? <laughs> uh, we're gonna do range combat. Uh, we're gonna do move and aim with position. Oh no, we got that already. Vicious cycle ability to follow a melee attack with a range attack for a massive meh. We'll do a focus shot. Yeah, that seems pretty uh pretty decent. Nice. <coughs> Alright, and again here guys, since this is uh, going to take quite a while to get over there, I'm just going to skip it for you guys, um, so it's a lot quicker. Um, and, you know, with me doing it like this, it gives me a lot more to show you, um, you know, in every episode which I bring out. Because um, otherwise you'll just... It's just going to be a long video, just me driving about, basically, you know what I'm saying? Um, and then coming across a little bit of action here and there. Um, someone do it like that, and hopefully uh, that's a lot better for yourselves. Um, instead of just watching me driving, you know? what I want. Good. Secured. Let's repair this again. Alright. Nice bottle. That's what we want. Grab that. Grab that. Uh, haven't got any pistol ammo, which is not good, but... <laughs> pistol? Nice. Hmm. 
Another bottle. That's what we like. Another bottle. Give me all these bottles, man. It's making me feel good. Ha ha ha. Shank. You are dead. Out the camp of freakers. Okay. You literally dodge your bullets sometimes. How many? Oh, that's crazy. I'm gonna run up and shank this dude. for his wife. Paying our respects. I still think she's alive. Personally, I think she's alive. If O'Brien's alive, I reckon she's alive. She has to be. Hey, it's okay. It's just my you told me that we shouldn't come back, and I didn't listen to you. I mean, I knew that it was getting worse, but I... None of us knew it was going to go like this. You don't understand. I don't know what I would do if I lost you. This is my fault. Hey. I won't lose a name. I made a promise. Remember? So I got Ben. Deacon, wait! Sarah, come on. There's a kid here. Wait. Hey. Oh, hey, are you okay? <laughs> come on, we gotta find your parents, okay? Really? Hey. Um, I don't know, I don't, I don't think it's that bad. Just hold this here as you can. Oh, I think I can walk. Yeah, they must have evacuated. Yeah, 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 they must have bugged the hell out. Yeah, she's burning out. The uh, knife must have nicked her kidney or something. She's turning this out. Mm. How you doing, little sister? So stupid. It was this little, this little kid. This, this goddamn little kid. Big goddamn knife. Hey, help me. Mm. Help me. Mm. 
Easy, easy. She reminded me so much of my little sister, you know. Because we used to play that hide and seek game all the time. She would just hide her head in her coat just like that. I've been cut my name, but nothing like that. She's burning up. Jesus. Look at him. We gotta move from here. We're gonna go that way. Ah. Come on. Alright. Hey, sweetheart, can you move? Oh, sir. Yeah, I got her. Go find us a way out. Oh, crap. Uh, okay. You get his attention. Whoa. I'll try to sneak up behind him, okay? It's nothing. It's nothing, Coco. I got this. Go. Hold on. Don't shoot. Just fuck you. I'm unarmed. Get out! Now listen to me, listen to me. My girl's out there, she's been stabbed. We're just trying to get to the roof. Get out There's a helicopter. You right killed her! There. So listen. You killed just... my wife! Oh, no, no, no. Look, I, I didn't know anything about no. your wife being killed. I'm sorry, sir. No, sir. Do it again. Get out of here! You killed my wife! You killed my wife! You killed my wife! You killed my wife! Stop that! Stop that! Yeah. Wait, we need help. She's been wounded. Well, what's wrong with her? Well, she's not. Whatever the hell's going on out there, she's been stabbed. I can't take anymore. Oh, okay. Listen, O'Brien. If we don't get wow. her to a hospital, That's she's crazy. going to die. There are no more hospitals. <laughs> oh, come on. No more hospitals. You got uh, doctors, you got triage, you got a mass unit. Oh, look, I'm just a grad student, okay? I, I got volunteers for this. I'm not even supposed to be out here, okay? Brian. There it is. Okay. Shit. Uh, I've only got room for two of you, okay? Two. Why you got room for two of you? We're overweight, okay? I can only take two of you. Two. <laughs> Come on, help me, come on. All right, sweetheart. It's okay. You're gonna be all right. I got her. I'm gonna be right back. Okay, Boozer, let's go. We gotta get on that guy. We gotta get on that show. I heard what he said. See what happens here then? Because there's... Obviously, he says there can be two people on there, but she's the only one that goes on. I'll be okay. Than this before. Yeah. Here we go. Where are you going? What? Where? Where? Refugee camp, west of Three Finger Jack. No. Boozer is never going to make it without me. There's no way you get it. Wow. 
I suppose you can't leave his brother behind, you know. Fair enough. That would be kind of peak if he just left them there, though, wouldn't it? Well, I right, see you in a bit, bro. Have a good one. <laughs> no. You, uh, you rest easy, okay? I'll, uh, I'll be back to check on you, man. I know. She's a hundred percent alive. There's no way that she's not dead. Uh, that she is dead. And there's no way. I can't help myself. It's uh. I'll be back. All right. Well, anyway, guys, we're gonna end it here. Um, thank you guys for watching this video. This has been a very, very good episode. Um, a lot of things are spicing up. I'm not even kidding, and I'm I'm even getting goosebumps. I'm not even joking. Um, I know you can't see it because my camera is uh, not that good. No. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm genuinely getting goosebumps over this game right now. It is getting to a point where it is getting really interesting, and I have no clue what to expect next. Like, I genuinely don't. Um, but uh, yeah, hope so. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, leave a thumbs up if you did, and if you want more of these, uh, more of these walkthroughs to come, um, they're going to be coming anyway. But you know, just to just to show a little bit of love for myself. Um, you know, because it all it it makes me so happy just seeing, you know, you guys giving me support, um, and it's just uh, yeah, it's great and I love it. Um, but uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching this video, and uh, I'll see you when I see you. Peace, guys.